everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Kate and today I'm going to be showing you my 16 month old daughter Ophelia's nursery. The items that are still available in the store I'm going to link below in the description box so be sure to check that out at the end of the video. First I'm going to start off by showing you the whole room and then I'm going to go into detail. We'll start off with the flowers. These flowers I made as a DIY project for her baby shower, uh, or for my baby shower, and they're really easy to make. All you need is cardstock from Michaels or Joann's, and a glue stick, and some scissors. And I'll um, link the template below that I've used to cut the petals out, and then you, to curl them, you roll them around the, um, glue stick and then I'll show you how I make the centers as well. But these are super easy and I just attach them to the wall with um, little sticky things from Joann's. I can't think of the word at the moment. Um, command, command strips, that's what those are. But these are the flowers. And some of the cardstock has a sheen on it, and some of it's matte. Just decided to mix it up. Those are her flowers. They easily come on and off the wall. This blanket I got on an Etsy shop, which I will link. The back of it is pretty fluffy. The crib sheet is from Target, and this pull-down bunny crib toy is from Nordstrom. She really loves that. Her crib is from a website called Bratz Decor, and it's a metal with distressed features. Crib skirt is a petal color from Restoration Hardware, and her blanket is also her quilt blanket is also from Restoration Hardware, and the gold basket is from Target. Her newborn picture, which I got printed out. Um, I just ordered a canvas from Walgreens.com, and it actually came out really well. And it wraps around the side. Her flamingo is from Anthropology, and her chair is from Restoration Hardware. She loves climbing up in it and reading her books. Her unicorn rocker is from Home Goods, and her end table is from. Restoration Hardware, and it's part of her set. The ballerina doll is from Target. And the Jack in the Box Bear is a yard sale find. These are all her books. The glass doorknobs on her closet doors are from Home Depot. My husband just took out the old ones and put on the new ones, and it came out really nice. Goes well with her room. 
The mirror is from a local shop called Adjectives Market in Winter Park. And as you can see, her chandelier is from Party Barn Kids, as well as the silk core cover. This is gorgeous. The silk core cover just adds a little bit more detail. Take a peek into her closet. And as you can tell, she doesn't need any more clothes, but we can help it. Here we have some storage. And this is how I like to keep her shoes. I'll link that down below. It's an Amazon storage cubby. And we actually did a DIY with a command strip hook and just a piece of ribbon. Added that to a hook, a hoop from Joanne's to organize all her bows. Then my husband did a DIY project for us, and he just cut a um, wood trim piece from Home Depot, and then sc screwed in these hooks here for all of her hats. It's a nice hat storage project. These comfy pillows are from Home Goods, and I think her lamb came from Macy's, I believe. And her hamper is from Restoration Hardware, as well as her pedal ruffle hamper liner. Her bunny mobile is from a local baby boutique called Tugboat and Bird. And we hung out. Changing pad liner is from Potter Barn Kids. It's the softest material. Here, just a shabby chic basket for her diapers and changing pad liners and gloves. And we love this Ubi white holder. I like the gray and white color because it matches her room so well. And her lamp is from Restoration Hardware. And it just gives off a soft light at night, so when I change her, it doesn't really wake her up too much. Trash can we got on Amazon, and it's an automatic <coughs> hands-free trash can. You just wave your hand over, and it opens. And her dresser is from Restoration Hardware, and the changing topper comes off. So when she gets older, you can just remove that. It's a really cool, shabby sheet. If I can focus in on the doorknob. The handle pulls are really cool as well as the keyholes. There we go. Her rocking chair is also from Restoration Hardware, as well as the poof. Two shelves are from Restoration Hardware. Baby and Child Restoration Hardware, so the baby section. These are just some Yadro figurines to go with the muted colors in her room. Her bookshelf is from Restoration Hardware as well. It has one drawer at the bottom for extra toy storage. Here at the top we have Beautiful Swan, and that is from Target. The Eiffel Tower is from Joann's. See, the white flower frame is from Marshalls, I believe. And the two first tooth and first curl bunnies are from Mud Pie online. The Hello World frame came from Bye Bye Baby. And this was a yard sale find. We have her camera for her 
We have the monitor and we have the dome sound machine, which we love. This Paris print is from Rifle Paper Company, which I think you can find online. And the frame is from Joanne. knickknacks on her shelf. Little bracelet with an inscription on it. The bunny jewelry holder is from Kohl's. The swan is from Home Goods. These two baskets are from West Elm. And the bunny was from Home Goods. This has some seasonal books. basket down here. The basket was from Amazon and I think most of her stuffed animals are from Nordstrom. I got on Etsy. It's really cool for the goods. Go. And I'll link it the Etsy shop below. And she does all different animals with the embroidery. And the measurement chart is from Kohl's. And we have another glass doorknob that we added to her front door. That was a yard sale find. You can just switch out any normal doorknob for a glass one to make your nursery even more girly. And lastly, this is Letter O from Pottery Barn Kids from Ophelia. Alright everyone, thank you for watching. And please like this video if you liked it and subscribe to my channel if you're new. Thank you, bye.